Hi, I'm Robert Osborne. Thanks for joining us as we once again honor our stars of the month for June. All the great pinup girls whose faces and figures have livened up military lockers and bulletin boards and magazine interiors through the decades. The dream girls of their eras. Well, this week we look at some of the dream girls and fantasy figures of the 60s and 70s. We begin with the film starring a good friend of ours here at TCM, Raquel Welch, a guest programmer of ours here in April of 2010. And with Raquel, we're going to go back in time for a fantasy adventure from 20th Century Fox in 1966 for a film in which she plays a peace-loving cave woman named Luana, who falls in love with a member of a rival tribe with extra complications thrown into the mix because Luana and the boyfriend also have to deal with several dinosaurs that gum up the works. This movie is actually a remake of a film from the early 40s and a breakout movie for Raquel one which led to an iconic pinup poster from that era in which Raquel famously wore an animal pelt bikini. Raquel's road to fame was a particularly interesting one, you know. It took quite a while for her to find success. As a struggling actress and model in the early 60s, she was often barely able to pay her rent. Then she met a press agent who got behind her and began marketing Raquel as a sex spot in Hollywood and all over Europe. That at a time when Sophia and Gina and Silvana and so many Vaboom European girls were all the rage. Scantily clad photos of Raquel looking provocative flooded the marketplace. And like Jane Russell a generation earlier, Raquel became famous as a sex symbol before she'd ever been seen in a movie. Raquel has rarely been out of the public eye since. And here she is the same year she was also seen in the much revered sci-fi film Fantastic Voyage. From 1966, one of the great pinup girls of the 1960s in a movie called One Million Years B.C.